All right, everyone. We're gonna take a look from another returning Star Strike character, Abuki, in Super Street Fighter Four. Um, Abuki's playstyle changed from all three series, from starting from Street Fighter Three, New Generation, Second Impact, Third Strike. They totally changed her in every way from those three games. And in Super Street Fighter Four, she is totally different from the way she used to be in any of the other series. Um, one of the cool things about her is that her air kunai. You can do it really, really low. So it's like it's a way to build meter and just like frustrate people at the same time, you know. Way. Um, another good thing about her is that she has a lot of target combos. Some are, and most of them are super jump cancelable. So one of them is um the main one is um light punch, medium punch, into um, crouching heavy kick into standing heavy kick. And you can jump after it, or you can um, super jump cancel into a dash. For a, for a better opportunity mix up. Um, another good thing is that she's, besides her third strike combos, She's able to combo with Street Fighter 4 type of engine combo, so she can do links like as low jab, low jab, and the standing medium kick. And when you do that, you can special move cancel into into, a th into the grab or or into the core circle back kick. But what makes her really good is that since she has a um, super jump cancel. She can do any type of string. She can do any type of string that's um, that she can super jump cancel and make it safe. So you can do standing fierce and you can jump. You can, you can even do that string. You can do standing medium kick and jump cancel out of it. So she's basically another version of Viper but like the ninja form. And she has a lot of tricks. Which which is very useful with the the tiger knee air kunai. So she can do like some akuma tips where if she knocks you down, she can cross you up with the kunai and then follow up with like a combo. So you can keep doing this because you cannot tech roll from it since it's a ground grab and you're able to do air kunai and you can just keep repeating the pattern over and over again to mix up the opponent and you can stay even stay on the same side. Um, what one of her um, cool combos in the corner is that she can link in crouching, crouching jab, crouching jab into standing medium kick, into the EX version of core circle back kick, into any special move you want after it. So that's one of my favorite combos of her. Um, Another thing is that when you want to use her command dash, her light kick doesn't go through, her medium kick version doesn't go through, only the heavy kick goes through. So after a throw, you can do some cool stuff such like this and land on the other side. Or you could just do... So basically it's, it's a guess even after a throw. Um, the, made, the most major way to, to cancel her ultra is basically using any of the moves that you're able to super, can, super jump cancel out of, like standing fierce for example, and you can input an ultra. You have to do a double quarter circle forward and then hit the up forward motion and press three kick. So that's one way to combo her ultra, and probably the most way that I would think that everyone would do is off of the one of her target combos, the standing standing light punch, standing medium punch, standing heavy punch. You can super jump cancel into that ultra. And that's a uh, and that's the uh, another look of a Buki, um, another returning Thresher character in Super Street Fighter 4.